Uh, today we're marking the 10th anniversary of our very successful civil forfeiture program and there's a good reason why we're doing it here in the Lower Mainland and with these particular vehicles here behind us. This vehicle is also amongst many linked to gun violence. In some cases, police have referred vehicles to the civil forfeiture's office after finding a loaded firearm in an illegal hidden compartment. And that's civil forfeiture 101. If you got through that unlawful activity or, need, or you use it to commit a crime, it really isn't yours. We need that to sink in for young people as part of a broader message from police. If you get involved in the drug trade or associate with gangsters, it can cost you everything. Gang life showed me true hopelessness and forced me to make choices that have had dire consequences in my life and in the lives of those around me. Gang life showed me how to bury friends, how to hold widows as they cried for their husbands, and it forced me to watch as many of the people I knew went from lively young men, full of promise, to drug addicted, desperate, and out of options. It's not a magic bullet by any means, but what it is and will continue to be is one of the many tools at our disposal to help stop some of the most dangerous criminal activity that's affecting our communities.